and it's been a dry St Patrick's Day so far but we do have a little bit of rain around tonight and our weather becomes more unsettled this week. Find out how unsettled a little bit later on. Yeah, special green jacket for St Patrick's yeah, Day. Sorry, well. I let the side down there, didn't I? No, it's very nice. <laughs> next it's year. not very green. No, it's not. <laughs> okay, next tonight, a reminder about the people's millions and the thousands of pounds up for grabs to voluntary groups looking to make a difference to the lives of people in their communities. The People's Millions is a partner. Brilliant. What's <laughs> this programme called? <laughs> Loving it. OK, Brilliant. and tickets for Brast Off, which looks fab, are on sale at the Octagon. The show is between May the 15th and June the 14th. Now, are we going to be brassed off about the weather? Joe, last week was dry, but I guess it's not going to stay that way. It was too good to last, wasn't it, really? Yes, things are turning a little bit cloudier, windier, wetter and chillier from Wednesday onwards as high pressure well and truly slips away and we'll see some fronts pushing in from the west, bringing us some spells of rain over the next few days and nights, as well as that quite windy from tonight. Temperature-wise, just going back down to a seasonal average, but it will feel a little bit chillier. Here are a few more details. <laughs> So starting from tonight, winds are picking up a little bit and by midweek we could see some gales. We'll keep you posted on that. Other than that, things are feeling less mild over the next few days and nights. There will be some rain at times and those winds are picking up certainly over the next few hours or so. We've got a cold front pushing in from the west overnight tonight. Winds will increase along the coast and up on higher ground. Generally the rain is light and patchy. It'll slowly push inland over the next few hours or so. Certainly after midnight we will see a bit more. Those winds increase in strength. Five or six Celsius the overnight low, so no problems with frost tonight. Those are the sun times. It'll rise at 6.19 and sets at 20 past 6 tomorrow evening. A grey start of the day and I'm afraid we have a little second wave on that cold front which will give us some heavy, steady rain for a time tomorrow morning. I think things will improve into the afternoon. Slightly brighter sky is the best place for any sunshine. Probably parts of Cheshire, Merseyside. Elsewhere, cloud will linger and we could see some light rain on and off throughout the afternoon. Temperature-wise, at the moment, not doing too badly. 10 or 11, maybe squeezing 12 Celsius here and there. And I think on Wednesday, Wednesday, generally not looking too bad until later on and then it becomes a little bit chillier and very unsettled to end the week. Thanks Joe. that's it from us for this evening. The national and international news is next with Mary and Mark. You can keep up to date though of course with all the Northwest news on our website that's at itv.com slash Granada. I'll be back with the late news that's at 10.30. Until then thanks for watching.